So you have a resistor and filament lamp connected in series with a power supply. They never give us a cute picture. Leh. Then my later we draw. So they give us the two IV graphs for resistor and filament. Potential difference across resistor is 3.3. What is the resistance of the lamp? If I don't know where to start, or I'll just draw a circular. Okay, so we have power supply. And in series, you have resistor, you have lamp. Filament lamp. Ah. Okay, so hmm, potential difference across the resistor is 3.3 volts. That is a clue. I have to start with that. The only clue I have is the graph. So let's try to look at the graph. If you have 3.3 volts, where is 3.3? Ah? This is 246. Oh, 3.3 is somewhere here. Let's draw some dotted lines up. Nice. So it intersects 0 0.3. That means the current flowing through this, uh, this uh, resistor is going to be 0 0.3 amps. But this current is the same value that is going to flow through the filament lamp also. Because there are, there are only one loop, right? the current didn't split here, split there. So now I have to check part two. Okay, 0 0.3 amps. They have the same current. What is the voltage or potential difference across the filament lamp? Track down. This looks like 4.2. So that means this lamp will have a potential difference of 4.2 volts. Nice. We are slowly unraveling the question. But they want resistance of the lamp. So the last step we need to do is to do our VIR calculation for the lamp itself. Because you see, we know V, we know I. So for the lamp, V equals to IR, R equals to V over I, which is 4.2 over 0.3. What we get are 14. So we say 14 ohm. Here we'll choose best answer D.